today, um, we're going to be starting a new lesson on different climate talks, okay? So we're going to start by going over our standards and objectives that align with this lesson. They're right here on the board, so y'all can refer back to them throughout the lesson if you need to. The first one is that I can plan and employ effective research strategies to locate information and other resources for my intellectual or creative pursuits. And the other one is I can collect information from a variety of sources to describe climate in different regions of the world. So we're obviously going to be talking about different kind of climates, how climates are different from place to place. But before we get started on that, um, we need to go over some safety protocols since we will be using our Chromebooks later in this lesson. So who can raise their hand and tell me an internet safety rule that you already know that we've talked about this year before? Something important. Owen? Um, don't, no, do not always press pop-up screens. Right, a lot of times when we're on the computers, so all pop-up ads will come up, and those are not good to click on sometimes. Very good. Brantley? Um, if you're on a lesson, do not get on something else that you're not supposed to get. Very good. If you're on the lesson, you stay on the lesson exactly what you're supposed to be on. We'll need to practice that later today. That's a good one. Myla? When you're on a game, Right, your name or address, do not give out your personal information. Just sit down. That's a very big one. Okay, so very good. There are some more, of, of course, but one of the first ones that I did want to talk about was not sharing your personal information, which is what she just told us. Um, you should not do this during any school hours on any school computers ever. The only people that need your personal information here already have it, like me or the principal. So if anyone else or any website ever asks for anything like your full name, your birthday, your parents' name, just raise your hand, I'll come look at your computer, don't click anything else on that. Okay, so later during this lesson, you'll be placed into groups, and one of the first things you're going to do as a group is watch um, a video on internet safety together. I'll send that link out through your Schoology account, so you within your group are going to be able to watch that on internet safety, um, and then discuss that within your groups together. Okay, so also before we get started on the climate, we need to talk about citing and referencing since you're going to do a lot of research for this project. So when I say citing on an author or a person, does anyone have an idea what that means? Or to reference someone? Owen, do you have a guess? Um, you forgot? Anyone? Just, just maybe. What do you think? Everyone? Compare, kind of. So sometimes when you do research, you have to pull information that other people have already found. We're going to be researching climates, so you're probably going to pull up a bunch of articles after you research, and you're going to use information that someone else has already found from a different website. So when you put that information into your project with your group, you have to give the person who wrote it originally credit. But that's not your idea, it was their idea. So we're going to have a reference list at the end of our project that has all of the other author's names and websites or books that you found the information from. Um, we're also going to watch another video on that together on the smart board just in a minute after we get that. So that will clarify a lot of that and we'll work on that together and once we do get our Chromebooks out. Okay, so once again, like I said, we'll be working in groups, but each member in the group is still going to have to do their own part in the project, okay? Um, since we're working in groups, there will be no cheating whatsoever or giving your friends any of the answers. So within the groups, each member is going to have something different that they're in charge of that they're supposed to find about the climate that you're given, okay? So you're going to do your work. You're going to find what you're supposed to. If you need help, of course, that's why you're in a group. But you're not going to do the work for someone else in your group, and they're not going to do the work for you. Everyone's going to do their own part. Um, we treat working on the computers the same way that we do on paper. So, of course, when we have tests, um, 
there is no cheating, so it's going to be the exact same when we're on the Chromebook. So we can this off. Finally, we'll all get the own Chromebooks um, in about five minutes, just the ones you've been using all year. And we will start with the video that I sent you again for Schoology. So everyone will get the same amount of time to research your comment top. So we can everyone will get to work together. But before we get started on that, let's think about what we already know about climate. Just about the word climate or the definition or the different types of climate. Anything you know about that? There we go. The weather, kind of, very good. So, will you come up here under this no section and just write weather? So, on this chart up there, as y'all can see, there's three different sections. The first one is no. It's going to be things that we already previously know about climate that you know right now. Um, the middle is want to know. So after we plot the first section, we're going to think of things that we want to know or questions we have or things we can learn. And then after the project's over, we'll come back and go to learn and talk about the things that we learned about climate after the lesson. Okay, Clayton, what do you already know about climate? All the different places in the world, like most of the time, all the depth, all the weather is different. Different, very good. So the climate's just not the same everywhere always. Yes, very good. Okay, so you come up here and under no, write different climates. Just spell it the best you can, okay? So we know that the climate is kind of talking about the weather. We also know that the climates are different in places, which are both very true. Okay, Brantley, what do you know? Um, the climate is technically about the weather. I mean, the temperature. Temperature. The weather. Okay, very good. So you come up after Clayton, and why don't you write the temperature? Yes, ma'am. Clayton, you can go get your markers differently. Very good. Myla, what about you? What do you already know? Sometimes it's cold, sometimes it's hot. Sometimes it's cold, sometimes it's hot. So, um, the climate or the weather can change. It goes hot sometimes, cold sometimes, very good. We'll just kind of leave that one under weather, but that is true. Pedro, did you have something you wanted to add? Uh, sometimes, um, sometimes we just go there and say, 